other top story. Our cameras were rolling as the driver plowed through a crowd during a May Day protest in Durham. CBS North Carolina's Amy Cutler joins us live from the Durham Police Station with their reaction to what happened. Amy. Sharon, it happened right here in front of the Durham County Detention Center. Protesters tried to block him, but it was clear he was not going to stop. There was a large group of protesters blocking the road, and then you see the pickup truck. The driver moves slow at first. Protesters try to block that vehicle, but it was no use. Those protesters in the vest, they're marshals there to watch out for those making their voices heard. Then the driver begins to pick up speed, and with that, he was gone. There were kids there. Um, there were people with different mobilities that weren't able to just run and pick up and move. Um, and so everyone, no one was injured. Um, but it was really scary, and it was scary to see that blatant disregard for human well-being. A new bill would protect that driver even if he were to hit a protester. It would exempt them from civil liability for a protester's injuries. That is, if the driver were exercising due care. That bill cleared the house last week. <laughs> Now, I just checked with Durham police regarding if uh, a police report was put out on this incident. We still have not heard back. Uh, as for that bill, it remains in the Senate in the Rules Committee. Live in Durham, I'm Amy Cutler, CBS, North Carolina.